Hey there, today it's time for my first official club tour of FIFA 18. I haven't done one yet, it's time to show you guys my official club. It's a very different club, I think FIFA 15 and FIFA, in fact FIFA 16 is my most stacked club ever. I had so many gold cards as well, whereas this year I've got so many special cards, not many cards like Ronaldo or even like Suarez. I've really not really gone for gold cards this year, first time, I've spent a lot less than FIFA points, so it's been an interesting year. However, as you can see, 19.2 million coins there with transfer profit, insane. Now, 270k from uh, match earnings, not that much to compare to my Road to Glory because I've played a lot more on PS4 this year. Two to three million club value and top squad is just terrible. So I need to actually build a full squad, but still, let's get into my first club tour, guys, in FIFA 18. To show you what I mean with gold cards, look at my club, man. I've used so many on SBCs. As you can see, there's literally just like no one um, in the club for gold cards compared to previous years. However, silvers, I do have a lot of cards um, stacked up from... Oh, there you go. I've got that guy as well. Cristiano. I forgot about him. He's the first card you see there. He was 230k at the time. I think he's a bit cheaper now. I'll have a quick look. He is, compare price, my phone's going at the same time. 120k on the market right now is Cristiano. 115, 160 there as well. Brilliant card for a silver. He should realistically be like 50k maybe. Um, but still, it's a cool card to have. In terms of silvers, I've got so many 74 rated silvers. It's actually insane. Premier League, let's have a look. Premier League, yeah. Some good Premier League cards there as well. We've got Gomez, who is a beast on the game. Really good card. Um, yeah, very cool card. However, for me, where it gets interesting after these cards, I've got a lot of bronze cards as well from doing the daily objectives. They're the, to be honest, it's not even worth showing you more of the non-special cards because I haven't really got many. However, where it does get interesting, kicking things off, is the lone players there. We've got the lone icon Schmeichel, lone Petit as well. Let's get into where things get a bit crazy. So special cards this year, as you can see, we've got quite a few icons already. We've got four icons, so I think I've spent around maybe four million coins on those four. I think, maybe less actually. Del Piero is 1.2, he was like a million, maybe three million. I've got more though. However, the first one, Del Piero, fantastic card, very good record right there with Del Piero as well. Dennis Bergkamp, I got him for like one, I think it was one million coins from doing the SBC. Fantastic card and need to actually get to using his card, that would be pretty cool for Can. The main man, Andrea Perlo, really nice card, very obviously insane passing, 99 passing there for his FIFA card. Next up is Rui Costa again. Something about these like center forward cards this year, they're very good to use. Rui Costa's long shot are very good in game as well. 85, but he feels like he's got 95 long shots. Really cool icon card. Edinson Cavani got him from doing the League SBC card. Deco, again, another icon for me. I kind of wish I didn't do Deco, just because I'm not using, I'm, I'm using I'm using this account, guys, as like a pack account, an SBC account this year. So not really using the cards too much, but I will get around to it. Uh, David Silva as well, 90 rated. I have been playing a lot more FIFA this week just to practice and get better. Harry Kane, centre mid. Um, he was obviously a striker from Play of the Month. Really cool card for him. Next up is Arturo Vidal, one of my best packed cards this year. First owner as well, um, with him 85 physical, 84 defending. You'd think his card stats would be better, considering he's an 88. He hasn't even got 188 rating on his like front of his card. Um, but when you get into his stats, you can see why he's that rating. 89 shot power there, 88 long shots, great overall stats. A few 90s there as well, 94 aggression with Arturo Vidal. So, after Vidal, we have got the likes of Mohamed Salah, my main man who I did get the pleasure to meet at the, I think it was like, was it December? When, when did I get him? First owner. I think it was December 10th or something like that. It was a dream come true to meet just a meal of player man, it was just sick. Um, but yeah, it was really cool. And yeah, he's the, he's the guy. Wouldn't it be funny if I got like a special card with myself presenting Salah the card. That would be insane, just saying yeah. Anyway, lovely guy, great card, 96 pace, 87 shot, 92 dribbling for Mo Salah, and he's there. Another player of the month we, we already got as well is, um, yeah, Sergio Mane. I think Mane presented uh, Mane, was it this year? Maybe last year's um, FIFA card, but, but brilliant card. 89 dribbling again, need to use this card more. I know I've used him a lot. He's actually probably one of my most used cards in the game, but I want to get using these cards more, man. I just, I'm getting 
more into playing FIFA now. Um, Icardi, in form, he was a first owner one. Very nice card. You got Mustafi, I think, uh, yeah, packed him as well. Untradeable item. Charisma, SBC card, an amazing card. Again, need to use him. We've got Zignac uh, there from, uh, is it Tigres in, uh, where is he from there? Yeah, Tigres in Liga Bang, uh, Liga Mexico. He is another SPC league card. Casillas, again, nice card, 86 rating. Prom is a very nice card. I've only, I haven't even used him yet. I need to get to use his card as well. Icardi, I've used him a few times in the, foot, it was the foot champs, yeah, eight goals, sorry, six um, goals in eight games and eight assists. Very nice card. Underrated card is Icardi. Very interesting stats. I've used him in my PS4. What was it? PS4? Yeah, my PS4 or main account, not Road to Glory. Leroy Sane is a card you guys know. This, for me, is one of the worst cards I've ever used in my life. I cannot... It's bizarre. Honestly, his touch is atrocious. It's weird. He is a fantastic player in real life, guys. Yet, for some reason on FIFA, he is just awful. I've said it so much, he is just not good at all. Yet, you look at his stats and they're good. He just can't seem to finish. His touch is so bad. And I hate saying it, I'm never this negative about a card, but I'm telling you guys bluntly and realistically here, guys, he's just not very good. And I don't like saying that, but I'm happy I've got his card. But in-game, he's just not, he's not good. Anyway, we've got um, Inform Insign. I think he was first though in a pack as well, untradeable. I've got Al Sommer. Again, need to use him. He is amazing. Very nice stats there in-game. I've used his 80, was it? Hasn't he got like an Inform this year, maybe last year? It was really good. Footmas, Asper, Laqueta, Kula, Bali, Footmas, Draxler, Footmas there, Mkhitaryan, Footmas, Herrera, Footmas, Otamendi. Um, monthly card, they've got uh, Valeri, pretty nice card there for him, 85 over rating. Footmas, Lamar, very nice card. You've got Van Dijk, who hopefully is going to get a ones to watch card very soon. We've got Kramaric there, we have Brozovic, who's got a pretty cool card. Gabriel Jesus is insane in this game. Very, I really do love this guy a lot in the in autumn team. Um, we've got Fekir from uh, Leon, really nice card as well. We have Christianton in my club, guys, on FIFA 18. We've got Eunice there, who again, a bit of an underused card. 92 dribbling for him. 99 balance. You know what? This guy is going to be insane in game. Very cool card. Finishing 78, composure 74. But look at that dribbling. 95 dribbling there for Eunice. We have Gomez, and a really nice card. I think, have I. I could, oh no, I thought I could trade him. He's untradeable. Berardi, Footmas. We have um, Mounier, one of the best cards in the game this year. Look at those overall ratings. In, just an incredible card. We have Marcos Alonso. Uh, Moy, in form. We've got Pizzi, in form. We've got um, Brand, uh, monthly, well, kind of in form. Luz Gustavo, Grand Fist. We've got more from Reading. He's, a very, he's got a really nice card this year. Antonio, who again need to use him. Uh, Rugani as well, Footmas. We've got Footmas, Muriel. This guy is an incredible card. Really, really nice card. And yeah, I can't speak highly enough of Bartra's card. Really good at like intercepting the ball. These are some more monthlies though, guys. I whiz through these now. There are the monthly cards. We've got, Ru um, what's his name? Rigoni, who again, a bit like um, Eunice. A very cool card in game. Very nice indeed. Next card though, after that, um, after that play Path to Glory card, we got Maguire, very nice super sub. He used him as a centre mid. We have this centre back for the play of the year for Norway in the Norwegian league. We have Nabri. We have Andy Carroll, Buffal. Um, Yun is that Yun? It's hard to say that guy's name. Yunusovic, one of the best free kick takers in the world, as you can see. Very nice. And in fact, last year he had better stats, but still nice stats in game. Just realised, 95 balance. What the hell? Wow. Uh, Bender, we got Boateng there. I think he is. Uh, yeah, they're both untradeable. Next up, we got uh, Valencia. Pere Pereiro, who has got a good career ahead of him. And there you go. There are the final three cards in my club in FIFA 18, guys. We've got the likes of um, Zuba there. Alex Hunter, who I've used a few times, and then, only once actually, then Williams as well as my final card. He was surprisingly good. Alex Hunter, for me, that was a bit better um, in-game. But yeah, that is, guys, my club tour in FIFA 18. Seven, no, eight pages of special cards. As you guys can see, there they are for you to see again. I love doing these kind of videos. It's really cool to show, show off who I've got. Salah is just ridiculous in-game, no matter what card you use of him. For me, my top five... In this FIFA from the special cards I've got. Salah, play of the month. Um, and I've only used him once, but I've used him in I've used his striker card a lot, his inform, and he's just magnificent. Salah would be in top five. Um, who else is in there? Del Piero 100 percent 
Um, you know what? Cavani is a beast in game as well. I'll put him in top five. So yeah, we've got Del Piero, um, Cavani, Mo Salah, Vidal, and then a bit of a surprise, I'd go with Icardi. I really like his card a lot this year. He's got decent pace, doesn't really need the skill moves, very nice in game. But yeah, guys, there is my official club tour in FIFA 18. What are your thoughts? Let me know. Aspilicueta is a beast as well. Can't speak highly enough of him. What are your thoughts though? Do I need to maybe get my opening more packs? I want to get, I think it's Hamsik. He's got an SBC card right now. So I've got two more to go and get. I did just sell someone. Who just sold? Oh, that guy sold for a max by now. That's a surprise. Yeah, I need to go and get some more SBC cards. Um, I pretty much got every single SBC card except about maybe eight of the footmas cards. So yeah, it's a really stacked club right now to the max. I'm not sure if I should get the icons. Um, I just think it, I, with team of the year around the corner, guys, I just need the coins. So I've got all of these icons I could get as well. As you can see, I could get how many? I could get 12 more icons in the game. Like, comment down below saying yes or no and give me a reason as to why that would be pretty cool. Anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Have a great day. That was my official first ever club tour in FIFA 18. There it is again. I mean, it's so... I love this club, man. I know I haven't got many gold cards at all, but who cares when you've got all of these crazy SBC cards. What an addition SBCs are to the game. There you go. Perlo, what a card.